Okay guys, welcome to my channel, Wendy's Kooky Crochet Tutorial. So this is kind of an update on the other video that I made about um, scammers on Etsy. So not even 24 hours before I got the last message that I got, I got a, another message from, um, I don't know, a different scammer, maybe the same scammer, I, I don't know. But this one looked legit. I mean, logo was right, everything was right on this, except, of course, in my other video, I let you know um, some hints and stuff, except that it came, again, into my inbox. It had a direct call for action, and it looked genuinely legit so scammers are really getting good out there at this kind of stuff and before yesterday I had no idea that this stuff even existed in the Etsy platform but it obviously does especially since I have gotten now two scam messages within less than 24 hours of each other I just can't believe that it's just bam bam like that right in a row and if I hadn't got the first one that looked absolutely not legitimate and then I went and researched and um, found out what what does an actual message from Etsy look like how you know what to look for all of that if I hadn't went and researched that I may have actually fallen for this one because it really looks legit it does not look like this is a scam at all so I'm going to show you guys again screenshots and everything so you can see what this looks like because I don't want you to fall for something like this especially you know if you're on Etsy at all this kind of stuff is out there and it is happening all the time Here's a screenshot of the message that I got. It pretty much says the same thing as the message that I got less than 24 hours ago. So, like, literally, this is almost no time this went by, and I've gotten two scam messages. So, this message says the sales in your uh, store are temporarily suspended, and to get it back, I have to provide my email address so they can send a verification form. So, how do I know that this is um, not legit? Of course, I already put this in my spam folder. The reason I put it in my spam folder right away is because um, Etsy kind of dings sellers if they don't reply to messages from um, potential buyers or for whoever sends you a message if you don't reply right away. So they kind of ding your store if you don't do that. But anyway, so this is a call to action. So I know that this is not legit because again, Etsy has all my information. They have my email address. Why would they need my email address? They, they already have it. So that's ridiculous. But this, again, if I hadn't known this, if I hadn't looked this up yesterday, I would have thought this is legit, dude. And here's the next page. So this pretty much just says that they need my email address and that I um, have to send it to them to get my account restored or not suspended. And so I thought I was good. I would mess with them a little bit. So I sent like a fake email address. So I'm sorry, someone, if you actually have this email address, but it's I love scammers at gmail.com. I just sent that. I, thought, huh, I wonder if they will actually send me anything back because that's kind of that's kind of crazy. And then I was just kind of ticked off and wanted to mess with them a little bit. But if that's literally legitimately your email address, sorry about that. But after I sent it, I got this message back, what I thought was pretty kind of crazy. So they did send me something back and said, follow the link from the email. The email usually arrives three to five minutes after sending it. Please check your spam folder if you don't see it in your inbox. And if you're having trouble, they actually sent a QR code that you could scan with your phone. Now, the thing that bothers me or the thing that I think about this is, um, one, this looks legit, guys. The Etsy logo's there. It says tech support. I mean, this looks like it could actually be from Etsy, especially since the logo is so prominent. But again, it came to my inbox. Now, this page has the QR code. And this QR code actually looks like it could be from Etsy, guys. Like it has, again, the Etsy logo, the Etsy font. It's even the orange colors that's kind of Etsy's known for. So this legitimately looks like it could be from Etsy. And if I hadn't have done that research before, I literally would maybe have fallen for this and thought this is from Etsy. But me knowing that Etsy won't send you anything, um, 
will, will not send you anything like this at all. And if you have a legitimate um, anything from Etsy, that they will have something in the column that says from Etsy. And dude, I didn't even know that column existed. And here's why I thought this could be legit before. So you look at this. The logo looks like it is from Etsy. The font's the same, the round dot's the same. Now this has got to be super easy to duplicate. And honestly, you could probably go on Google and copy and paste the logo for all I know. So that's probably something easy that scammers can do that make it look legit and make you more likely to click on something like this. Another thing that makes this look like this actually could be from tech support is it's spelled right. Tech is kind of spelled right. Support is spelled right. So this is spelled right. So again, this looks like it could be legit here. The key thing to know that is really, really not from Etsy is it came in my inbox. It did not come from the Etsy tab there. So I've got my uh, red arrow there where the actual from Etsy tab is. And I before I looked this up, I didn't even know there was a from Etsy tab. I had not paid attention to that at all. But here is the Etsy tab. And if you, if Etsy needs any communication to you at all or from you, it will be in that tab that says from Etsy. Thanks for watching the video, everyone. If you liked what you saw, please subscribe to my channel. Again, this, I never, ever, ever make these kinds of videos. I just didn't know this kinds of stuff was happening out there at all. And this one looked so incredibly legit. I'm so glad that I got the one that didn't look legit before I got this one, because this one really did look like a message from Etsy. And and it's just it's just absolutely crazy what's going on and that there are people just out there wanting to scam you all the time is what it seems like to me. Um, again, stay safe out there. Um, if you like the video, subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends, your family, um, anybody that you know that has an Etsy shop or is thinking about it because I hope this really helps them out and I hope it really helps you out too and makes you aware of what's going on out there. And I know it sounds like, oh, I don't wanna be scary or whatever, but it's important and crazy stuff keeps happening like this and it's just I don't know it's just crazy out there so stay safe everyone um, subscribe to my channel um, like the video and share it with whoever you think might need this information and might need to see what's going on um, thanks again and happy hooking everybody